This video is supported by the Vanguard Gamer. Check out his channel today for Halo 5 Game Nights, Halo 5 Machinimas, and Halo 5 Theories. Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome to the top 5 worst Halo clan leaders and figures. Today, we're going to be discussing, basically, the top 5 worst leaders, scummy leaders, asshole leaders, and just terrible leaders of the Halo clan community. So, for this list, we scrapped together people that fit this description perfectly. I took suggestions from everybody around the Halo clan community, and basically, a lot of this is going to be in my opinion and what I know on them that made them one of the five uh, top worst leaders within the Halo clan community. So, I hope you guys enjoy it, and we're going to get right into this. Starting off the list at number 5, we have the UN Director. UN Director goes by many gamer tags, but he's just well known for UN Director. Uh, he's well known for creating the fake United Nations clan, a perfect example of being one of the first people within the Halo clan community to steal names and tarnish the original clan name. He is notorious for being one of the most despised people within the Halo clan community because of his constant trolling to multiple clans within the Halo clan community. There are multiple stories that people can share of their not so fond experience with UN Director, which earns him number 5 on our countdown. The next person on our list is, is someone that isn't really well known within the Halo Clan community, however his actions make him number 4 on our list. Illusion X Marine is well known for being the leader and the founder of the Delta Force Clan from Halo 2, hence the reason why the clan is called Delta Force. Illusion started and earned his worst title when losing multiple competitive games to clans such as Wolves of War, The Metal Uprising, and Joker Nation, even though in that he bragged he was a Halo 2 competitive champion player. Illusion continued to worsen his career when turning his clan into a military clan. Illusion was notorious for trash talking, threatening to hack small clans, including to claim that he was a Marine for the United States. On multiple occasions, Illusion would threaten to hunt and kill people just because they upset him over Xbox. All this while he had a 5 year old daughter in his clan. Rumors and stories of Illusion's whereabouts are said that he is currently serving time behind bars and that he had his child taken away from him by social services. This makes Illusion, Illusion number 4 on our list. The next person on our list is someone that I can pretty much guarantee you guys all agree with. Wolverine653 or Commando Art takes number 3 on the worst clan leaders and figures list. He is best known for stealing clan names, emblems, gamertag, maps, and pictures. Pretty much everything and anything you could think of. Although he stole all these things from many clans, every clan that Ark has led was terrible and always ended within a couple weeks to a few months. Ark is also well known over the Facebook groups for trash talking many big clans and also claiming that he is dominating the Halo clan community, even though his clan is on Halo Reach and all the most successful clans are on Halo 5. <clears throat> this makes Ark number 3 on our list. The next person on our list is Marshall Goldpack. He takes number 2 for leading one of the worst clans within the Halo clan community called Goldpack. The biggest reason that he is on the worst clan leaders and figures list is he was kicked out of his own clan. As shown on the video Goldpack uh, clan exposed by the 99th regiment clan, we can see pretty much Goldpack losing multiple competitive games to the 99th clan. He is also shown towards the end pretty much being kicked out of his own clan by his members, which is honestly something that is really humiliating considering that he founded and led the clan, Goldpack. He is well known within the kick chats for the Halo clan community for being an idiot and just ruining the overall image of himself and the clan that he leads. Marshall Goldpack takes number two on our list. Before we announce our pick for the number one worst clan leader and figure, here are a few honorable mentions. Leglink or UNSE Kurt 051 is probably the person you expect to see on this list. From the time that Kurt started to get minor publicity within the Halo Clan community, he started to show signs of just being purely stupid. Leglink started to his fall to the bottom when trying to be like one of the original intelligent agencies within the community, the Panthers. 
After creating his clan, the Splinter Cell, he began a long war with Panther 13, also known as Vanelli, to somehow try and expose the Panthers and constantly calling them out. After a long struggle, he was finally humiliated by the Panther group and went into hiding. It wasn't until later that Leglink appeared in the community once more as the Spartan named Kurt051. Preaching that he was a Spartan from Halo 2, Kurt had also created the Facebook page and group titled the Halo Clan Community. Kurt had also created the clan name Highcom in which he gave a bad reputation when starting problems with Navcom in which he formed a complete ban on all Navcom members within his group. Naturally, Kurt received a lot of hate in which this caused him to lift the ban on all Navcom members and in a desperate attempt to call it a social experiment. He later ended Highcom and created a clan called the UNSC and claimed that all members that joined the clan were from the original UNSC clan from Halo Combat Evolved and Halo 2, even though he couldn't provide proof to back up his claim. He also created a website that he claimed was as old as Halo 2 even though the domain Weebly never existed till 2007, after Halo 2. Later on karma struck when Navcom hijacked Legling's Facebook group and removed all members from the group causing Legling to change the name of one of his old Facebook groups to the Halo Clan community as a desperate attempt to restore what he had lost. After the events of losing his Facebook group, Legling attempted to threaten multiple people within the Halo Clan community saying that he would sue them in court for harassment and bullying. Kinda sounds like someone we know right now, <laughs> doesn't it? Kurt to this day has made minor attempts to gain back the attention he once had, such as creating his own top 10 worst leaders as a response to hearing the production of this video. However, many people simply don't care about him as he's tarnished his career and image within the Halo clan community. This makes Kurt number one on the worst clan leaders and figures ever. If you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like. Also comment down below on what you guys thought of the people that were on the list. Once again, these are my thoughts and opinions on who I believe are the worst clan leaders and figures of the Halo clan community. Anyways guys, that is it for this video. Be sure to stay towards the end of the video for a special feature. Eyes in the sky, gazing far into the night. I raise my hand to the fire, but it's no use. Cause you can't stop it from shining through It's true, baby, let the light shine through If you believe it's true, baby, won't you let the light shine through You, you know it's weird, man? They used to have so many fucking friends. I don't even know what the fuck happened to him. Fuck him. <laughs> so I tell him like this, like, like, I, like, like, I guess if this is where we've come to, and you don't want to, then you don't have to believe me, but I won't be there when you go down. So you know now, you're on your own now, believe me. What's up, bro? This is gonna be the last post. I know, you've been thinking I'm an asshole. I've been living my path out. This is me alive, like I just took some bad salt. A lot of my mind just to the times that I was not judge and do everybody but who does except the fact that you wanna fuck stuff, now you out of the pack.